Okay, folks, this is FM 1431, two miles west of I-35. There's the Ikea store. You can probably see it from here. FM 1431, it's April 20th, 2016. Okay, here's your nectar, Indian paintbrushes, green threads, lots of nectar. Look at all the butterflies. You see all these butterflies? And hold this still. Probably a dozen should be, there should be at least a dozen in the frame right now. Lots of butterflies, lots of paintbrushes, lots of green threads, some other wildflowers. Okay, there's a little small antelope horn. Okay, there's lots of antelope horn. I just walked this way past a lot of antelope horn. I'm gonna come up some big plants, big antelope horn plants, but I wanted to show you all the nectar and all the beautiful wildflowers. Okay, here's some Mustang grapes. A lot of Mustang grapes. This is a native grape, the great state of Texas. Of course, there's your prickly pear blooming. It's a beautiful. There's your, there you have a sulfur. Right there's a sulfur on the on that uh, Indian. That's a Indian blanket. Of course, there we go. We have a beautiful, there's a honey bay right by the sulfur. They're all having fun. Beautiful. That's a very verbena down in there. This is a beautiful stand of wildflowers. You can see it right now. All, uh, okay, so oh, look at here. Look what we have here. This is my first queen of the year. My first queen. Let's see if this is male or female. Come on. Come on, lay it down. There you go. This is a, I think it's a female. Hold still. And this is a beautiful butterfly. This is my first queen of the year. My first queen. Likes that green thread. It's on that green thread. Hanging loose. Enjoying that green thread. My first plane, I've got to get a little better look at this lady. She's beautiful. There she is. Now I got her in focus. She's got her wings closed. But she's sitting on that green thread. She likes those green threads, folks. First queen, nice size queen, too. I've seen a queen get this year. There she goes, flying around. This is a beautiful pasture right here, full of all kinds of wildflowers. Pretty much native land. This land here hasn't been touched for probably forever. I don't think it's probably been a touch forever. It's been great. Okay, here's a beautiful, here's a beautiful animal. We got that female queen. Well, I don't know what she's been doing. Well, she's been laying any eggs. Don't see any eggs, okay? Here's another beautiful antelope horn right here. Lots of little butterflies. There's another big antelope horn right there. Lots of wildflowers, lots of prickly pear. Lots of, there's another, that's a clouded sulfur. Okay, look at these are buckeyes right here. Some beautiful buckeye butterflies right here. See the buckeyes on those? Beautiful butterflies right here. There's one right there. Got him? Am I getting him? Yeah, there he is. Buckeyes. Lots of different types of lots of different types pieces of wildflowers here. Spot. Another big large antelope horn here. Surrounded by Indian paintbrush. Aren't they beautiful?
We love it. Here's another big antelope hunt. Run on. Thank you, old fat here. Lots of nectar. Lots of Okay, look at here. Here's another one. Here we have a, here we have a, a black swallowtail. This black swallowtail. Coming over here once in a while. Oh, I thought he was going to be a pose. Interacting. What is that? Is that that queen? Is that a monarch? This is a monarch, folks. Unbelievable. There it goes. Monarch. Uh-oh. Interacting with another monarch. Come on back here, guys. Show us how you lay eggs on the milkweed. Come on. Come on back, folks. Plenty of big milkweed over here. There you go. We're seeing lots, I don't know, probably half a dozen species of butterfly in this one location. I think those monarchs are going to stay on that side of the fence. They landed on something. Okay, here's a nice stand of green threads, some more prickly pear. Blooming prickly pear, aren't they beautiful? All right, look, at that's a queen. Maybe those were queens. Those are big. Queens are big and beautiful. I tell you, they're every bit as pretty as, as monarchs. We got lots of queens. This must be the first flight of the year. Oh, I would have seen them. Here we go. Here's your prickly pear with blooms. Got new pads started. We've got new blooms started. Okay, there's another nectar. I don't know what he is, but he's something nectar in there. Lots of bees, lots of everything here. We have an entire ecosystem right here, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful stuff. Well, the butterfly man must stay here. Yeah, he, he likes to go with his beautiful butterfly stuff. Boy, there's a lot of them. Here's another. Big antelope horn. Look at the size of those leaves and the blossoms. And then you got some milkweed bugs on them. You got a little butterfly, some kind of nectar right there. Come on, tell me what you got. Well, quick, fast flyer there. All right. I've been running this a long time. You have to admit this is a beautiful stand of wildflowers. Needed milkweed, lots of butterflies. April 20th, 2016. There's something new. Looks like a fritillary. Beautiful little fritillary. Far spangled fritillary. I think what that is, but I could be wrong. Even a butterfly man don't know all the butterflies. Look at this beautiful. picked up the last couple of years, the milkweed and all these, a lot of these wildflowers are re-emerging after the dormancy of the drought we had from 09 to actually right up until 13. There goes one, that's a black swallowtail. I just wonder, I've been wanting to stop, I go by this place, I've been wanting to stop by this. Check out all the, the booms. There's a stand up. Green thread right here. Beautiful stuff. Craig the butterfly man. Don't see much trash either. No, not much trash. Well, they're liberal. They're not that strong Starbucks cup. I mean, you know, maybe it ain't a liberal, but you know, chances are. It takes a liberal to spend four bucks for coffee. 